So previously I'd sat on an exercise bike and filmed it with this very nice thermal camera which was bought through donations from a crowdfunder on this channel. And what that showed was amazing. That for the first seven minutes when you start to exercise, the outside body temperature drops like a rock. And then after that, the body starts to heat up again in this weird blotchy pattern and starts dumping the heat, mostly from the hands and arms, which is kind of neat. Then a week or two ago, someone sent me this question of do your feet warm up as well or is it just your hands here? So there was nothing for it but to get back on the exercise bike. So it's often the way in science that what you go looking for isn't actually what you find. So this is me getting on the exercise bike again. Now it actually turns out that the starting surface body temperature is contingent on all sorts of things that you wouldn't have thought were that important. But this time I actually started relatively cool. So I've got more or less the same temperature scale as I had previously. Now, what you'll see is occasionally there'll be these little flashes. That's me starting to put my palms down by my side so that you can see what's going on. And also, the exercise bike here runs on inductive friction. So as I pedal, I'm starting to generate heat. So what you'll see is, there it is, that's the exercise bike actually starting to heat up from all the exercise I'm doing. And at about the same time, you start to see that my arms are now dumping heat and you start to see that there is there is some on my back as well that is starting to to get hot now the really interesting thing here which wasn't what i was looking for at all is just compare my two hands my left hand and my right hand you'll see that my left hand is much hotter than my right and this is because about 10 years ago i came off my bicycle and broke my right wrist not that badly but badly enough to change the blood flow and uh, the mobility, such that now if I have my hand hung down by my side for too long, what tends to happen is the hand feels puffy. So here I am at the end, and this is more in real time, so you actually see just how much heat's been generated by this exercise bike. Now obviously as I get off and turn around, the left hand becomes, you know, stage left and all that sort of thing. And what you'll find is, again, my right hand is significantly cooler than my left hand. You can actually see the difference, these minor differences in the circulation from when I broke my wrist about 10 years ago, which I thought was just so cool it was worth sharing because sharing is caring. Share and enjoy. Share and enjoy. Share and enjoy. Oh, this is ridiculous. Let me out of here. Thank you. My pleasure. Oh.